What is good everybody? Welcome back to another My Damn Toys video. Today we have episode number 12 of My Damn Hauls. Um, I'm feeling really good because we actually get to upload these sort of close together and not like months apart. So it's really awesome. Very excited to get this thing out to you guys. We have three packages right here and I'm going to be dead honest with you. I can't even remember what is inside these packages. So it's going to be a surprise for me. Um, as well as you guys. So I don't even know what's in here. You see the MDT art on that back one. I think that is amazing. We have some fan mail, it seems, which is amazing. I think that's absolutely incredible. You guys are so great. I love each and every one of you. Um, it is just crazy to me to even think that I have fans. Like, that's just insanity. So thank you guys so very much for all of your continued support of the channel. I love you guys so much. But we have three packages here today. We do not have the package from BEW just yet with all the Randy Orton's. Cannot wait for those. Um, but here we have three packages, so let's go ahead and get straight into them. All right, guys, so this first package we have up is from my boy D. Huffman. Um, I believe this is a trade. Got some rippage on the back of the packaging there, but that is no biggie to me. It doesn't look like there's any damage there, so we will go ahead and just cut the top right off of this thing here. Now we'll slide the figures out, it looks like. And the figures we have in here is, okay, so I did not know that he was going to put a Shane McMahon in there. So the first figure we have up right here, let me go ahead and adjust this. Um, the first figures we have here are an Elite 35 Randy Orton. So I believe this is a trade that I did with one of my followers on Instagram. This is a trade, and um, you guys know I posted about Elite 35, or all the Elite Randy Ortons that I wanted to get. So I got this Elite 35 Randy Orton right there, which is so beautiful. I love the Elite 35. It has the bigger arms, which I appreciate, and this head scan is a lot better than the other ones. I'll probably end up doing a custom head or something with this one, but really awesome there. But this right here, I did not know I was going to be getting this. So shout-out to Huffman. Um, huge shout-out to Huffman. Thank you so much for this... Uh, Pretty much a free Shane McMahon. This was not part of our deal at all, so shout out to him. Awesome. I already have this figure, but I can already think of some things that I can do with this Shane McMahon. So thank you guys so much, um, or D. Huffman, I should thank you. Thank you so much for that Shane McMahon. That is the first package we got right here. Two awesome elite WWE figures. All right, guys, so this next package, I believe, is a trade as well. Um, I've already cut the seam right here, so all we have to do is slide that open right there. And I believe it bends this way. Yeah, it bends this way. So we open it up, and oh, Lord, we got a bunch of peanuts in there. Let's see if we can reach in and grab some goodies. Uh, I really don't want all these to spill out all over the ring, but, you know, what? Just, F it. Just, just F it all. Okay, so we have a Randy Orton here again. Um, in some bubble or some plastic wrap, it looks like, and I believe this is the Elite um, 12, maybe Randy Orton. And yeah, I believe this is Elite 12 Randy Orton. So we have this Elite 12 Randy Orton with the red trunks right there. Um, again, with all the custom Ortons, the reason I'm picking up all these Ortons will always be custom. So um, all these will be turned into different uh, Orton attire. So I believe that's the only figure in there. It may be two. Let's go ahead and check. I don't want to. You know, throw the ball. Okay, so we do have another figure in here. We have another figure, and it is the Elite 2 Randy Orton, and this is amazing. I'm really happy to have this one because I wanted to do a Wyatt family, uh, Bray Wyatt, and, you know, was, um, if you put a different head on here, you can do the uh, attire he wore at TLC when him and Bray Wyatt became SmackDown Live Tag Team Champions, so that's probably what I'll do with this one. So beautiful because he had the blue... Um, in his trunks there. So the black and blue looks amazing. Very happy with this figure overall. So that is the other package that we have on this episode. So let's move on to the third and final package. Alright guys, this last package is from Ian Varner and it looks like he put some MDT art here on the box which I think is absolutely sick. Um, he's got the MDT logo right there as you see. We got some pink and black marks going through the logo. Blue underline and it looks like he even put some zebra print in there which is amazing. And we got the little yellow on the uh, US Postal Service logo right there which is sick. Nice touch bro. Really enjoy this box art. I think that's so cool that he even did that. but. I'm going to go ahead and peel this little part off right here and just reach on in here. All right, so we got some bubble wrappage right there. And then if you look on the inside, it looks like we have two different or... Okay, so we got a baggie right there with a figure in it. And then we got more stuffing. 
And then it looks like we have another uh, thing with a note and another figure of some sort. So let's go ahead and move this box out of the way. All right, guys, so it looks like we have two figures right here. But the first thing we have right here is another... I know you guys are probably already sick of it, but I don't think this is a piece of paper um, or a note or anything. I think it's just a white blank piece of paper there. And, yeah, it's just a white piece of... I think it's just to uh, protect the figure. Um, let's go ahead and open this and make sure that is the same case for this one. And, yeah, it's just white paper. Um, so I'm glad to pick up that paper. We really needed that, but obviously that's just joking. But... We have Randy Orton right here, so we get another Elite 35 Randy Orton, and this figure is actually pretty rare. So um, this this is probably one of the better Elite um, Randy Ortons because of the blue trunk. So a lot of people are um, looking for this figure, and um, since I did just get so many customs made from BDW, it's nice to pick up um, two more in this episode so that we can do more Randy Orton customs. So now we have four Elite Randy Ortons on this episode of My Damn Halls. But now we have this other thing. He threw this in for free, so I guess you can call this fan mail since we got a letter here and some other goodies, um, which is so amazing. Thank you guys so much for that. But we'll take this out right here, and it looks like we got a head scan right here, and it looks like it is Sami Zayn, um, which I could use. I will definitely be using this for some fodder parts. And then we have this right here, and it looks like it's sort of like a custom and I don't know if this is supposed to be me or not, but regardless, I can definitely use this so much. So thank you so much to Ian. Um, we got an Xbox lower. Well, it looks like it was a Sami Zayn or something. Um, I don't know if that he put that or that may be a Mattel chest that got the hair rubbed off or whatever. But um, we got an Xbox torso, it looks like, with the uh, tattoo removed. That's what it looks like. It looks like a, a torso swap on an Xbox with um, Xbox arms and a Miz head scan. But I can definitely use this. I actually wanted to... Um, do a uh, hurricane a hurricane elite custom so this may definitely be turned into that but regardless of the case this is amazing man thank you so much for that and it looks like we have a i get is this the back part of a phone like what is that? i don't even know what this is but it looks like the back part of an iphone or something so i don't know what this is but it's pretty cool regardless to say. So that's pretty awesome. I don't even know. You'll have to tell me what this is. But that's really cool. I like that regardless. Got the MDT blue right here. Maybe I can do something with the back of that. Maybe put a graphic on it or something. But here we have a letter. And what it says is for MDT. I love your videos. Thank you for trading with me. Please give me a shout out. Thanks. So huge shout out to Ian. Thank you so much, man. Thank you so much for loving my videos, and thank you for watching, and shout out to him. Um, if I can, I'll leave a link to his Instagram below, but thank you guys so much. That means so much to me. You guys are amazing, but here we have the uh, custom or whatever it is that he says. fodder regardless. It's amazing, so thank you, and now we will take a look at everything we picked up today. All right, guys, so here we have everything that we picked up on today's episode of My Damn Halls. Thank you guys so very much for the to the people that I traded with to uh, the fans that send in the fan mail, thank you so very much. Like, I cannot express how much um, appreciation that I have for all of you guys who follow and support this channel. You guys are amazing. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. We got four sick Randy Orton figures to make customs with. We got a custom, it looks like custom tray or some fodder pieces regardless of the case. We got a Sami Zayn head, a Randy Orton t-shirt to go with the figure, an elite Shane McMahon that I had no idea I was getting, and then we have this iPhone or back of an iPhone which is incredible as well. So thank you so much for the fan mail again and thank you guys so much for watching subscribe for more epic wwe and wwe figure related videos and i will see you guys in the next video thank you so much